guys welcome back to the channel we're going to be doing some testing of this photonis 4g echo tube we're in a open field at the moment and um, it's pretty dark i can't see there's no moonlight so we've just got ambient lighting from residential properties so i'm going to do a test just to show you some of the quality but you can see here at the moment it's been working fantastically through my pvs 14 but this tube is a multi-alkali tube it's a hybrid system it's not a traditional one that you get with the gen 2 or gen 3 but yeah, enjoy. Just want to give you guys that opportunity to save some money when you're looking to buy tubes, really. So yeah, hope it's really helpful for you guys and uh, speak soon. Anyway guys, um, I hope this video has been helpful for you. Photonis 4G Echo Tubes, they're really great. They're a great alternative to Gen 3 tubes. I think the quality is on par as you can tell. Um, the camera does actually struggle to film through it, so what you see through your actual naked eye is so much better and so much clearer because you don't have to worry about two electronic things focusing. So as you can see here, I'm really clear. So um, it's worth having a look at an investment if you've got different tubes option, if you're building a, a set of uh, night vision, or if you're a little bit curious and you wanna see what sort of quality you're gonna get if you invest your money in something like a photonic tube. So this is white phosphor. They do it in green as well, but um, white seems to be the way to go. Just gives you a little bit nicer contrast. But um, that's pretty much it guys. So um, thanks for watching. I hope it's uh, helpful to you. Nice short video for you just to show you some of the um, examples of the tube and what sort of quality you're going to be getting out of it. And uh, guys, take care and I'll see you on the next one. Thank you.